here on Pepe Farm, we like to do things a little differently. So this is Leaf and um, we think we're the first school to have a school sheepdog and in the summer he's going to go to a farm in Cumbria and, um, and then in the autumn he's going to go for proper training and then when, when he comes back he's going to work with our sheep. On the Wirral we at this particular school were able to offer a broad and balanced curriculum especially when we got a phenomenal facility such as the school farm. Not every student uh, on the Wirral is academically gifted and it's very important that we're able to offer such a diverse range of subjects and this one really really allows students to come into their own. Roles have fallen across across the world. Uh, last year we were down at 140, this year it's gone up and there's a lot of comparisons, a lot of impact that the farm is doing with an awful lot of primary in reach. Um, visitors to the school are delighted by seeing something like this. They find it unusual, unique and such a benefit to our students. Hello, these are um, Tamworth pigs and we're growing them and breed, well, breed and growing them for our uh, meat production. This is an example of one of our lambs that will be grown on the farm and sold for meat. It was very useful last year when we were doing GCSE business studies and level two um, enterprise that we had um, a business within the school that the students could uh, do as part of their studies and demonstrate customer service skills within an enterprise situation that they could then comment on and write about in their work. It's important to learn where our food comes from and our farm to fork to farm program uh, teaches about where like where our lamb and lambs and our pork come from. The farm is really what sets our school aside from other schools in the area. For example, we really um, meet the specific needs of our students and the kind of skills they require. They come down onto the farm, they you know they help with the feeding of the animal animals, the breeding of the animals and um, they, it helps them if they wanted to go into veterinary and um, also they help um, schools from around the area integrate so they work with year six schools and that really helps um, children also wanting to come to our school and um, so it's really really great as a whole for the students and the area. Hi my name's Leaf. I'm kind of new around here. Got my eye on them sheep over there. Can't wait to get me paws on them. Um, the course also offers a lot of unique aspects on it. Um, most recently they just welcomed their own sheepdog to the farm, which has been a massive success. He's been used in everyday farming um, between the teacher, Peter, and the students. They've also been um, starting their own breeding programme where they're breeding their own sheep, pigs and goats, which are then being sent to other schools that are starting up a school farm after they've seen what a success it's been here. I believe we're the only school in Merseyside that actually takes farm to fork. It may cause a few uh, eyebrows to be raised uh, now and again, but uh, it's important that our young people know where their, where their food comes from uh, in the world and that we can actually develop food compassionately. The farm also has helped us uh, increase numbers at the school. Our numbers are rapidly increasing because we're meeting the aspira aspirations of our young people and the parents in the neighbourhood. This is some of the artwork that has been inspired by the farm. Um, teaching courses like this in schools is absolutely amazing, both for students and the agricultural industry. For students, it really um, allows them to see the full process of farming from food to fork, including the marketing side of things, the business side of things, and of course, most importantly, the animal welfare. We help set up a farm at Grove Street Prime School, and these are our pygmy goats that we breed. And we, get, we help them by giving them our two kids. Hi, I'm Meg Marshall, I'm head teacher of Grove Street Primary School and we have very strong links with Bebbington High School, not, not least our wonderful farm here behind us. We have three chickens and two pygmy goats, Sooty and Sweep here, and uh, we're very, very proud of our links with the high school and it's helped us to be really innovative. Uh, we've shown our pygmy goats at the Cheshire Show and won many rosettes and, and, and medals here. And uh, we've got eco for families here. There's an eco course on here this morning. And also it means that um, we're the first primary school in the UK to actually care for pygmy goats.
We hope that you agree that this this short film has given you an insight into how we'd like to do things a little bit differently here at Bevington High Sports College.